All right, here we go. We are reacting to the Sonic the Hedgehog 3 official trailer. Oh, my goodness, I'm so excited. Let's hop into this. Sonic, you finally found your family. Try to keep up. And I know it hasn't always been easy, but you didn't change who you are in here. Love. Yeah, in my, in my lungs. lungs. Or your heart. <laughs> I love Tom. Pretty breach. Shadow! Oh. We need Team Sonic's immediate assistance. Project your shadow, shadow broke is out. far beyond anything we've ever encountered. It began a lot like your Sonic. But were you found Maria. family and friends? Uh, Alright, we got a rogue alien on the loose. How do we find it? Start with the giant fireball? I love it. Let's start okay. with the giant fireball. So we, oh! He jumped out of the helicopter. I don't know if that's his SA2 reference, but I'm more seeing this. much more impressive than the hedgehog I fought previously. Dude, I'm standing right here. <laughs> You're a colorful bunch. We don't want to fight you. Actually, Sonic, I would like to fight. No, no. <laughs> I love Knuckles. Ooh! My turn. He has chaos control. He has chaos control! Oh, he's using the jet shoes. The air shoes. Whoa. He's too powerful. Sonic! Oh, that's Tom. Tom is in the military outfit. Wait. Doctor. <laughs> we have visitors. This is sad, Robert. Oh. Even for you. We need your help. On one condition. Oh, gosh. What? Do this! He's let himself go. I can't rule the world. I don't have the proper material. <laughs> I love that. When we're done, there won't be anything left. The motorcycle! Oh! Oh, the plane living lord! Wait, was that a chow? Wait. Oh my goodness, this is so hype. I. Ah. Oh god, I. Mm. Welcome home, my boy. Gerald? It's, it's impossible. Is it? We couldn't, couldn't it? I am. Are you? In, In the saggy, saggy flesh. Wait, Gerald's alive? Wait, oh, okay, okay. Whoa, 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 okay. So, Gerald's alive. Okay, so, okay. Let's go to the bingo board real quick. Before we, let's go to the bingo board. Let's see what we got. So, I'm going to kind of... So we're gonna do. We're gonna watch through it, and we're gonna just pause a lot. This is the cave he lived in in the fourth movie, right here. That's not his uh, his bedroom in the attic. This is his his cave from the fourth movie. I bet that's what. Uh, what was it? This is. Yeah, cause there was the one hundred fifty mile per hour sign, or two. No, that's two hundred fifty mile per hour sign. This is his cave. Oh, I love this little drawing, too, of him and, um, Longclaw. And, of course, a little Green Hill Zone loop-de-loop, -loop, but... So, this is where Shadow's being held at, which I think this could be a generic, like, um, government base. I don't... I, they might call it Prison Island. This could be Prison Island, like, from the games, Shadow was stored on Prison Island. So, they could, like... That, that could be an easy reference. This is gonna be like, like... Like, he broke out of Prison Island. And it's a wef... Like, it, it... That's one of those references that works with the plot. But it also doesn't necessarily, like, mean anything. Like, oh, Prison Island. How... Like, no duh, it's a prison on an island. Oh, gosh, that design... Like, we'll finally see in the full design and all of its glory. That looks awesome. That looks awesome, man. I, I just want to highlight this design. They did a great job adapting Shadow to the movies. There's Maria! There's Maria! There she is! Sorry. I'm, I, I'm excited. <laughs> that has to be jailed right there, then. That's Shadow. That's jailed. And that's Gun. Or well, not Gun. Because in this universe, Gun wasn't founded until after Sonic arrived on Earth. As far as we know, they could, they could be like, oh, Gun's been around ever since Shadow or whatever. They could change that. That's definitely Gerald. Also, I love all my boys. Look at them all together. Team, and they called him Team Sonic. Which I think it's the first time they've been called Team Sonic, if I'm not mistaken. So that's another cool little reference. 
This Quill, I'm going back to my fan theory for Sonic 1. He's going to use the Quill to power his own Sonic. He's going to get Metal Sonic. I, I am I am going to keep saying Metal Sonic's going to be in this film. I don't know. At the end of the day, I'm just happy. Honestly, I'm really excited for this film. If we, if we get Metal Sonic or Amy, whoever, I, I can really care less. Um, but I just... I, I've had this theory way, all the way back when he had the Quill in the Force movie. Like, you not, you can use this to power your own Sonic robot. This Chow! Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. There's Chow in the background. Look at the Chow! Wait! Wait! Bingo board, didn't we say chow? We said chow, didn't we? We did! Wait a minute! There's chow! That's nine, baby! So he calls him Papa, Jim uh, Robotnik does. Which in the games, Jared Robotnik is his grandfather. Which would be fair, some people call their grandfathers Papa. Like Papa. Or like Grandpapa. But you know, Papa is typically dad. Which he could go with you, because in Jim Carrey's Robotnik, I believe, is older than Eggman in the games. And, you know, it doesn't really matter too much. Like, you know, Jim Carrey's... Well, it's hard to say Jim Carrey, because they're both Jim Carrey. They're both Jim Carrey! <laughs> but Robotnik and Gerald, you know, Robotnik's older, Gerald's older, so it still fits with the whole 50 years ago. Because we do know the whole Shadow thing happened 50 years ago. We heard that in the second film thing, but okay. Awesome. So that, that's the Sonic 3, Sonic the Hedgehog 3 trailer. The, the start of a fantastic marketing campaign, I feel, I hear, I feel it.